We started early. So we have <laughs> half an hour to talk. Okay. <clears throat> start with uh, Representative Hutchinson, please. I'll start by saying I, 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 I do appreciate appreciate uh, the the the, uh, the fact that you were talking about uh, the fine line between criminal and civil penalty. That 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 is a legitimate uh, concern, uh, and, and I appreciate that. But but as I listened to your testimony, I. I, I I, I, I heard it going back and forth and back and forth, and I, and I, I just boil it down to one, one question. Do you or do you not support the employment of illegal immigrants in your industry? We don't support the employment of illegal immigrants, but we are also recognizing the reality, and that is that 75% of our agricultural workforce is illegal. So there, there is the world as we would like it to be, and then there is the world as it is. And we're, we're trying to find a solution that enables us to transition to a legal workforce and at the same time not to lose our farms. Um, again, 75% of the workforce estimated to be illegal in agriculture, and that's a low-end estimate. Some of the estimates are higher. I don't have anything else to ask right now. Maybe you'll have some 